1972, October. My wife and I were in the house sleeping. 3 a.m. I had some missionaries visiting me from England. We have no air condition, we have no fan, we have newspapers. And these British friends from Liverpool are not used to newspaper air condition. So they opened their window down for air to come in. And three o'clock in the morning, seven men, thieves, came to my house. Three o'clock in the morning. And they saw the window open. And they lifted the head of one of the mission. They said, Get up! Bring your money. Jumped up. He said, Who are you? He said, We are men of underworld. And he said, I'm not the owner of the house, I'm a visitor. So he passed. He got out of his room. He said, Let me call the landlord. <laughs> <laughs> Say hallelujah. So he came to my section and he called my wife. Mr. Zidahosa, Mrs. Zidahosa. I was speaking in tongues of mine. She got up and said, Yes, what is that? He said, There are seven people in the house. He said, They are thieves and they want me. My wife burst in tongues. No, the pastors in my house, eight of them began to speak in tongues. And the thief said, Shut up! And they shut up. They closed their mouth. They came to me, they said there are seven teams. <coughs> they want to take our properties. I said, no. They said, teams. They said, let us pray. I said, I prayed before they came. Everybody said, I prayed before they came. I marched to the door. I took my Bible. I said, Who do you say you are? They said, We are men of the night. I said, I'm the man of the afternoon. I said, are you ready for me? They said, no, sir. I said, hold on five minutes. I'm going to kill all of you right now. And seven men fled and jumped in the bush.